1970 Plymouth AAR Cuda Hardtop. Uh, Tor Red over Black, which Tor Red is short for orange. <laughs> Good. I'm glad you said that because, yeah. Is it, that, am I missing something? It's very reddish orange. Well, carousel red on a GTO is the same way. Mm -hmm. It's more orange than it is red. Yeah. Kathy would be proud of me for not saying orange. Orange. She says I say orange real hillbilly like. <laughs> orange, Kathy. Yeah. See, I can enunciate. <laughs> It is, it is orangish red. Yeah, 47,000 actual miles. It's got a correct 340 cubic inch six pack V8 and a correct A727 torque flag automatic. And what do we mean by correct? As we always say, it's correct for the car, but it's not the original to the car, mm -hmm. uh, which is okay. Listen, these cars were <laughs> driven hard and put up wet. Um, mostly original interior, all original metal, nicely restored. Um, you know, Plymouth back in the day hired Dan Gurney's All American Racers in California to build a Trans Am Cuda, AAR All American Racers, mm -hmm. hence the name. Gotcha. And uh, man, but this car is just, I don't know, there's something about an AAR Cuda that gets people excited. Even if jaded car guys that it have is. seen everything. Yeah. You know. And I know that it fits like pony car slash muscle car. It, sure. is, it is the quintessential muscle car. I yeah. think it really is. And people go, oh, it's only got a 340 in it. Yeah. So, only? Just the, How about a 302 and a DZ302 Z28? Only 302? How about a 289 and a Mustang Keiko? Right. Plus the ex all the exterior parts of it. Yeah. You know, just tough looking car. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah, it really. And nicely restored. Uh, it's very yeah. well done. Mm -hmm. Love that car.